Hello everyone, Robert Rambles here, and welcome to World of Warcraft Wrath of the Lich King Classic, and the beginning of a Blood Elf Priest playthrough. That's right, the journey continues today to find the class that I uh, actually sync with on the Horde side of things. So today we're going to be trying out a Blood Elf Priest. Some of the most fun I've had in the game was back in the Vanilla Classic on a Human Priest. And I'm hoping to recapture some of that fun here on the Horde side. Thank you guys so much for being here. If you're new to the channel, a couple of things we have going on. Uh, we are using the Immersion add-on here to change our quest boxes into this text, which is going to make it e easier for me to read. I do read most of the quests, and I don't tend to play World of Warcraft like most people that you see on the internet. I just try to have a relaxing time and quest through the world and... Explore, try to get immersed. I keep the sound for music and ambience up to kind of help us, you know, just get into things. Hope you guys are into that. Thank you for being here. And let's just get going here. Reclaiming Sunstrider Isle. The sooner you begin your education, the better for us all. There is little room for error, so listen closely. The burning crystals, the green floating objects to the west of the Sunspire here, have long been used to power the Isle's experimentations. The Mana Worms were their guardians, but the Scourge invasion of Quel'Thalas has driven them errant from our lack of magical control over them. There is little choice but to thin their numbers for reclamation. Do this, then return to me. Keep your wits about you. Okay, so we are just going to go fight some Mana Worms. Pretty simple. We have Smite. Smite an enemy for 13 to 17 holy damage. We have Lesser Heal. Heals our target for 46 to 56. And we have Arcane Torrent, which silences all enemies within 8 yards for 2 seconds and restores 6% of our mana. So we don't have to mana tap anymore. Mana tapping was removed in Wrath of the Lich King, so... No more mana tap, it's just Arcane Torrent now. I'm going to do a couple of things. I am going to turn on... Some more action bars, firstly. Let's get that done. Let's turn some enemy nameplates on so you guys can more easily see the health. And we should probably start from as much range as we can here. Pretty cool casting animations for the Blood Elf females. What I really enjoyed most on the Priest, I remember, was being a caster, but having ways to make my mana last and last. Being able to go from pull to pull uh, without having any downtime, I think Spirit Tap was essential in that. We were getting mana back after every kill. So yeah, I'm really looking forward to being able to be a caster, but not really have to deal with drinking all the time. Pretty excited for that. Turning on auto loot would probably be a great idea, so that I'm also... You know, looting stuff. Alright, one more, and then we can head back. A 
I feel like possibly the music could come up a little bit, but you guys let me know uh, if anything needs to be adjusted. We can definitely get it taken care of. I'm going to leave it about right there for now. The music here is absolutely amazing, so... Victory lies ahead. You have successfully completed your first task. For that, you are to be congratulated with a cloth belt. Let's equip the pants also. Unfortunate measures. Your effort has made something clear that honestly I wish were not true. The unchecked power of the burning crystals has maligned a much larger swath of the isle's natural balance than I thought. We must now take a more un unfortunate measure to reclaim control. The nearby lynxes have succumbed to the influence of the crystals, but and they must be put down. Bring me their collars, as I may yet be able to fashion a magical restraint to turn some back from being uncontrolled. Be ready for anything. I don't think that follow-up quest ever got made. And priest training. Our class trainer would like to, to speak with us. us. Let's go do that first so we can learn our level 2 skills. Yes. Welcome, I am Matron Arena. Arena, perhaps? <laughs> Surely not pronounced like Arena. I offer my services to those who seek to learn the ways of the priest. Such a path is often misconstrued as a path of pacifism. For we blood elves, this couldn't be further from the truth. While we do mend both bone and spirit, we also act as a first, as a fist of vengeance for those who would transgress against us. I will train you, but all I ask is that you cover any training costs that may come up, and that you will learn with an open mind. If you agree to this, we may begin. Uh, I'm going to move these around a little bit. There we go. Should be good enough to lock them in place. And these are the default UI. I'm not using any UI add-ons besides Immersion. And then we're also using Questy. Well Watcher Selenian, now I need you to do something. Well Watcher Selenian is in need of your service. You would do well to ingratiate yourself with him. He awaits you on the exterior platform. The ramp in this chamber leads to. Salama so he's on the balcony. Nore. Let's check out level 2 skills. We got Power Word Fortitude. Power infuses the target, increasing their stamina by 3 for 30 minutes. Farewell. We will put that over here. And we'll want to keep that up at all times. Eternal sun guides us. The Sunspire held a beautiful vantage of the Sunwell once. Our lives have been turned upside down, Rambles, but we nonetheless carry on. It is our way, we are survivors. If you were to survive this upheaval, to carry on in your own right, then you must learn how to survive. All blood elves must do this. You must master your insatiable hungering for magic before it masters you. Ah, oh, good, a priest, I've been expecting you. There are a few tasks that I have which you are particularly suited to. He wants us to get his belongings here. With all the chaos happening here at the Sunspire, I haven't had a chance to collect my belongings I've left outside at various places on the Isle. I must maintain my vigil over the Sunwell here, so I'll ask you to collect them in my stead. Keep your wits about you. And then he wants us to visit the Shrine of Doth Rumar. Day after day I stand here watching, waiting. I've been accused of dwelling too much on our past while my eyes look to the horizon. But it is my firm belief that each visitor to this island should honor those who have sacrificed all so that they may continue to do so. Dothramar Sunstrider was our first king. He led us here from Kalimdor through the Maelstrom. Seek out his shrine to the west and do not return to me until you have read the plaque. Farewell. Do not come back. Victory lies ahead. It's a shame that we've lost control of many of the creatures here on the island. This was once a tranquil place of study and research. Now it's all we can do to keep from being attacked by our own creations. I'm going to offer you a chance to receive a magical boon in exchange for collecting some work on your part. Bring me a stack of arcane slivers. Farewell. 
Okay, found out all the mana dwelling creatures. And then Arcanist Helion here has Thirst Unending. If there was only one lesson you deign to remember from your time on Sunstrider Isle, let it be this. Control your thirst for magic. It is a thirst unending. Failure is to become one of the wretched. Hopelessly addicted and insane. Seek out a mana worm and unleash your arcane torrent upon it. Learn to master your power when you have sufficiently released an arcane torrent. Return to me. We used to have to use mana tap five times, I think. Now we have to sufficiently release an arcane torrent. So, take away from that what you will. We're going to walk up to this guy and we're going to hit three. And there we go. We have, in the, the ping for it is still called mana tap creature. Which is weird. <laughs> it's very weird that that didn't get updated, but it's fine. Uh, let's, let's, we'll turn this in when we turn everything in. We need arcane slivers from these same guys. I do like their casting animation. And we also need Lynx Collars, and we're looking for this guy's lost items. Usually I start over on the other side of things when I do our little loop here. So I, I'm actually going to go do that. We'll look for some Lynxes on the way. Oh, I feel bad having to kill the cub, too. Oh well, it's a world of Warcraft, not a world of fun petting zoo time. He'll probably have a collar. So we're grabbing the journal over here. We don't need the feral tenders yet. Let's just come over here and grab the scrying orb.
And now we just need to grab the scroll of magic and then we'll head over to the shrine and we'll read it. You discovered the location of the shrine. Upon further examination, you sense a stronger pulse of the strange power that has gripped the aisle. You feel a bit uncomfortable standing by the shrine, and perhaps a little disturbed. The bronze placard along the side of the shrine reads, Here stands the shrine of Dothramar, a fitting tribute to a noble elf. Let all who gaze on this monument remember his sacrifice against the scourge and his dedication to the cause of our continued survival. All who prosper and quell the loss do so thanks to him. Alright, probably won't uh, have another chance to use it so early, so let's go ahead and just pop our hearthstone. Get us a little closer to the turn-ins. And we do need to empty out the inventory. State your business. We will take the cloth. You're to report to my assistant, Lathan Perilon. He will instruct you on what needs to be done next. While we here at Sunspire will continue to reign in the Burning Crystals, you will be focused on a more pressing matter concerning Falthrian Academy. Okay. Let's equip those. We need to vendor, but let's turn into Selanian first. He's going to have an extra bag for us. State your business. Well done. I knew you'd be perfect for the task. Once it's safe to make use of our outdoor facilities on the aisle, I'll be putting these things to good use. Like I mentioned, please feel free to keep the satchel. Also, you may find this piece of armor to be useful. Uh, yes. Thank you for sharing your experience. First off, you should be commended for your sense of duty and respect. It will serve you well, not only here, but in all of Azeroth as well. As for the odd sensation, it is no doubt a contributing part of the taint that has befallen Sunstrider Isle. We shall keep an eye on it. Thank you for alerting us to it. The reckoning is at hand. Let's go ahead and equip the gloves. We will persevere. Oh, I actually want to read that. Many of the creatures here in the Isle were at one point bound into non-aggression and complacency by our magical skills. When the Scourge destroyed the Sunwell, our, our hold over these creatures shattered. Arcane slivers are the remnants of the control we once had, and as such might be, uh, might be usable in fashioning a new device to aid us in regaining their control. Death to all who oppose us! We got a Fortitude of the Sindora, increasing stamina and spirit by uh, 5, so... That's actually pretty big. I'll take it. What do you seek? Uh, let's go ahead and vendor everything here we don't need. We can equip this. We will have justice. What business have you? You've done well today. Your willingness to learn shows that you may very well rise above the unyielding cravings you must endure as a blood elf. Rest not on your laurels, young one, but instead seek to master what you have learned. Only through diligence will we as a race survive. Take the cloth pants. Time is of the essence. 
All right, and let's go report to the assistant. Victory lies ahead. Your continued service to the Blood Elves is paramount to our survival. We must all pitch in and pull ourselves out of the mire we all find ourselves in. If you're ready to work, let's get started. Magistrix Arona told me you'd be along quick enough. The Falthrian Academy to our west, the huge floating building with the ornate spires, is in bad shape. You're going to be leading the effort to recapture it from one of the wretched, a blood elf who has forever succumbed to their basest cravings. I hope you're ready to work. This is not only going to be a lesson about danger, but also of what happens when you forsake the realities of who you are. We will have justice. Aggression. Before sending you to the Academy, I want you on another task that needs to be dealt with immediately. Once used to aid us in the gardening of the Sunstrider Isle, the bestial tenders have now grown out of our control. Clear them out with due haste, but be warned, their lack of control has made them aggressive. It is such aggression that forces us to put down these once gentle servants. Yeah, they're actually not aggressive anymore. They were aggressive in, T in BC, but... Uh, then they changed it so nothing in any of the starting areas is aggressive. So yeah. Not aggressive anymore, not not either of the types. But it is funny that it's still in the quest text that they that it explained to the player, hey. Unlike other enemies you've faced, these are going to be aggressive. I don't know how much more clear you can make it. That's like a really cool staff attack. <laughs> the fact that that's how she attacks with her staff all the time is amazing. I, I need to see this some more. Oh, she's not doing it now. Oh, okay, so it's not every attack. We, we saw it twice in a row where she like spun it behind. Yeah, that one. So cool. Oh, man. Such a cool animation and like you would never really be anything that would use a staff to attack. Maybe a hunter in melee? If you have like some kind of agility spirit staff or something I guess, I don't know. But that's funny to have such a cool animation that like you would probably not really see. Unless you're me and you're like stupidly auto attacking. As a priest. <laughs> I did send us some bags from my bank alts, and I think a wand that we can use at level 9. We are about to run out of mana for the first time. That did not really regenerate a lot of mana at all. Now we do have... oh we had water! <laughs> And somebody, somebody sold it all. Yeah. Somebody sold it. 
Okay, we need the regular guys. It's okay, our natural regen right now is not bad. We spend a couple seconds out of combat. We'll skill up our staff fighting a little bit. Alright, let's go turn this one in. Might be a good time to run back up to the main base camp and buy a little bit of water. Maybe even vendor some stuff. We did hit level 4 so we could train as well. Yeah, let's do that. Let's, let's turn this one in. Let's go back and train. Empty our bags and buy a little bit of water if we can. Yes. Well, the death of the tenders gives me no joy whatsoever. It does show me that you're ready for the most important task you'll do here at Sunstrider Isle. Take this and put it to good use. You'll need you'll need good items and sharp wits for the task ahead. Our reassertion of control over the island depends on it. Uh, let's take the staff. Philendrin the Banished, a betrayer of our people, resides atop Falthrian Academy to the southwest. Philendrin is his name, and he was banished from Blood Elf lands for failing to heed the warnings of our teachers and elders. He is the worst of our society, as he lives only to feed his insatiable magical addiction. He refused to learn control, he is a shell of his former self, one of the wretched, and he is a threat to the Sunspire. Destroy him and the wraiths he uses as minions. Keep your wits about you. Okay, we will do that. However, let's go up here first. A new Bellore Delinar. We have Lesser Heal Rank 2, uh, but we also have Shadow Word Pain. A word of darkness that causes 30 shadow damage over 18 seconds. Remember the sun well. Let's go ahead and pull out Lesser Heal Rank 2. Probably don't need it on number 2. We are going to move Shadow Word Pain there. So I'll probably throw out a smite and then hit him with a Shadow Word Pain. And then maybe another smite. And that might take care of most things. Do a little bit of meleeing just to annoy people who get annoyed when I melee as a caster. Until we get a wand, obviously, then we'll be firing the wand off. Uh, let's let's hit the vendor over here really quick before we get too far. Space shouldn't be an issue right now, but you never know. Everything has a price. Salama
So we're looking for two different kinds of wraith. Um, the dark ones are going to drop an item that begins a quest. And there are typically fewer of them. I want to see how much this is going to tick for exactly. Yeah, see, that's not bad. It, it'll get a lot better when we have power word shield and they're not able to actually damage us. Need to make sure I'm starting more from my max distance. We didn't get water. That was the thing we forgot to do. Now we don't have to fight all of these guys, like, consecutively. Let's go up a little ways. See if we can find any of the, the shadow ones. Here's one of them, and we'll get the item off of him. Then we just have to find one more. You found an odd sliver of crystallized mana on the corpse of the tainted arcane wraith. The sliver is different than the others you may have seen in that it's as dark and sinister looking as the wraith you looted it from. Just holding it gives you a sense of unnatural foreboding. Arcanist Helion at the gazebo of the Sunspire just might be someone who would have a use for the sliver. Okay, now we need to find one more of those guys for the kill quest. And then we're heading up. We, we could probably head up. There might be one up there with him. So let's check that out. If not, we'll find one on the way down. But I feel like he usually has at least a couple of buddies up here with him. Yeah, look at that. That's two misses in a row. That's very unlucky. At least we have Shadow Word Pain doing work for us. Uh, I think we miss with both of our spells. Shadow Word Pain and... And Smite. Both missed. It's not what you want to see. Looks like we're going to get him anyway.
we need one more wraith. <laughs> ah, sorry for those of you who were yelling at me as I ran away from the platform. We need... I feel like I've done that exact thing before on this exact quest. Where I get to the top, I kill the guy, I get the ones that I know are more rare, and I think, oh, we're done. We found both the dark ones. We must be done. We're not done. Seven out of eight, Robert. Seven out of eight, my friend. There we go. Now I can actually see the turn-in that I was expecting. That was what clued me off, obviously, was seeing uh, that our, our buddy did not have a quest turn-in for us. We will persevere. Heed well this warning, Philendron the Banished is only a symptom of a much larger problem. His demise will solve our immediate concerns, but all Blood Elves share the potential same fate as him if we let our addictions get the best of us. You've succeeded where others like Philendron have utterly failed. Perhaps you are truly ready to be a contributing member of Blood Elf Society. We don't need either of these. Your success here means that you are capable of surviving the greater threats that lurk in Eversong, and believe me, there are plenty to face. Magistrix Arona wanted you to head over to the Silvermoon City in order to aid our reclamation efforts there. That is, once you had successfully addressed the situation at the Academy, you did not disappoint us. On your way to Falconwing Square, south of here, you should speak with Outrunner Alarion. She's not far from the bridge. The Outrunners take care of shuttling goods between here and the mainland, and since you've proven to be so resourceful, they could use your assistance. Hold your head high. Okay, uh, let's come over here. We have the item to turn in that we found on the Shadow Wraith. Let's go do that. Anaria Shola. From your demeanor, you seem to be on a matter of some urgency. Is there something specific I can assist you with? This is most interesting, and when I say interesting, I mean more disturbing than anything else. Our efforts to reassert control over the Isle in, in the time following the destruction of the Sunwell have been a challenge. I suspect that whatever foul source is corrupting the Isle is at the heart of it, it all. The Sliver may be some aid in uncovering what's really going on. You were wise to bring this to me. Take this as compensation. Keep your wits about you. All right, so uh, we're off to help the outrunners. What business have you? Hello there, priest. I heard that a resourceful young blood elf, formerly in the service of Magistrix Arona, might be making their way down here to help us outrunners out. We certainly welcome the help, especially from someone who's proven to be so competent. I hope you're interested in running an errand or two for us. Alright, let's go down the lane. We need to find out what happened to the last messenger that got sent through here.
and unsurprisingly, they're dead. The Outrunner's belongings have all been stolen with the exception of one package. It seems to match Alarian's description of Arona's package. Let's go tell her the bad news. to the Sindorai. What did you find? By the Sunwell. That's the third outrunner we've lost this month. I appreciate your courage in venturing into the dawning street. The guards need to keep a closer eye on these blasted wretched. The death of another outrunner is a true tragedy, but it's a risk we all accept when we take the job. Magistrix Arona at the Sunspire needs to get this package to the inn at Falconwing Square, and she needs it there as soon as possible. We're short-handed, and I don't have anyone else available to cover us. I'm not going to lie to you, the path down Falconwing Square can be extremely dangerous if you leave the safety of the lane. Do you feel up to it? I do. I do, and we're going to need the water, so we better do it. Alright, let's start grabbing the quest. Victory lies ahead. Major malfunction. The arcane patrollers crafted by our forefathers to protect the city have fallen into a dangerous state of disrepair. They fail to recognize us as their masters and will attack us on sight. Even though they were created many years ago, the arcane cores that power them are still quite useful and valuable to us. I want you to gather these cores and bring them to me so I can put them to good use again. You will find the patrollers in the ruined section of Silver Moon to the northwest. Alright. Let's grab the wanted poster. We need to bring Thalus' head to Sergeant Canren. The dark times will pass. Unstable mana crystals. A group of wretched recently raided a supply of unstable mana crystals from one of our arcane sanctums. If not handled properly, the crystals could explode with enough force to blow a hole in the city wall. Now, Rambles, I don't quite care if they blow themselves up while tapping unstable arcane sources, but the whole incident would make my men look bad. Bring me back any remaining stolen crystals you find. They might still be inside their original crates. Shirella Ron. I am going to go ahead and check the mail. We're going to grab our bags. And our, the wand we can't use yet. There we go. Perfect. I have one of a kind items. Let's make this in our home. Everything has a price. Welcome to the inn, priest. Am I to understand that you have something for me? Thank you, I do appreciate the prompt delivery. While you're here, please make yourself comfortable. If you haven't done so, feel free to get a hearthstone and bind yourself here. Yep, we did it. Let's grab the water. Time is of the essence. And let's let's grab a little bit of additional water in the form of milk. Yeah, we'll we'll have this out for now. And we'll uh we'll see how it goes, basically. Hold your head high. 
Uh, is there another quest? Cleansing the Scar. Is this a priest quest? It is a priest quest. It's good to see that you are here. The Scourge attack our city with such endless hate that I fear the morale of our guard is breaking. Hurry to the Dead Scar south of the city where Jayla and her rangers are. Stand ready. Fill them with the power of the light through your blessings. Oh, we get some cool robes from this. Very nice. Okay. Remember the sun well. Cool, cool. Do we have anything we need to what sell? Do you seek? Sell that. I think we could sell basically everything except for our consumables. Let's move those. We don't really have... They don't even want the item. We need to just destroy it, right? Okay. Uh, what about these? Yep. Put gear over here. Stay the course. All right, I think we're ready to head back out. Let's go do some of this really quick. Let's go do the arcane cores, the unstable mana crystals, and try to find Dalis's head. Should be able to get those things done. Of course, since I sent us a bunch of uh, bags, we get a r small red bag right away. Similar thing happened on our human warrior. I could probably avoid some of these guys, but... Yeah. Probably could avoid some of them. I think I'm still starting off combat way too close. I feel like we could probably be much further away.
Let's see if we can drink really quick, and then we can take on this golem. Already the refreshing water is not quite cutting it. I'm, I'm kind of glad that we do have some milk if we need it. Smite missed. Always painful. Alright, there's Thalys. Can we... Well, let's not do anything just yet. Let's approach this carefully. We don't have Powered Shield yet, so we're a little bit vulnerable at the moment. Maybe I can pull this guy on his own. That's a negative. Cannot pull that guy on his own. Do I need to save some mana here to heal? Let's heal, and then if we have to auto attack for a second, so be it. That was a miss. There we go. We need one more power core. That was bad. Should have probably drank there. There we go. And we can actually just hearth back because we remembered to set our hearthstone. So how amazing is that? Uh, let's visit our... Well, did we hit? We didn't hit level 6 yet. Let's go hit level 6 and then we'll visit the trainer. Pretty sure we'll get 6 with three of these to turn in. What business have you? You've done well. With our arcane sanctums not operating at full capacity, these power cores will go a long way in supplementing our needs. Delivery to the North Sanctum. I'm pleased to discover that you're at least somewhat competent. I'll give you another task, since you seem to be so eager to prove yourself. This is a letter to Laykeeper Cadenus, the arcanist in charge of the upkeep at the North Sanctum. Go southwest of Falco Wing Square and you will find him. He's a very important person, so I hope you don't bother him too much with trivial Stay chatter. Oh, rude, but okay. Our enemies will fall. And we'll turn in the kill quest. Remember the sun. Thalus's head. Anaria Shola. Besides the constant threat of the wretched, I also have to deal with all kinds of fictitious reports of night elf sightings. Though most reports are unfounded, one recent incident demands further investigation. The West Sanctum, one of our primary energy sources, has suffered a ter terrible malfunction. 
and rumors of Darnassian sabotage are rampant. Travel there and deal with anyone that looks suspicious. Report back to Lakekeeper Velania, who watches over the Sanctum. We will have justice. All right, we will do that. We did hit six. Let's go talk to our trainer back in the inn. We also got a uh, a new robe. There we go. Looking good. We'll get a better robe for uh, completing the priest quest. The cloaks in this game just... I've never been a fan of helmets or cloaks. There we go, now it's gonna get fun. Now we get Power Word Shield. Draws on the soul of the friendly target to shield them, absorbing 44 damage last 30 seconds. While the shield holds, spellcasting will not be interrupted by damage. One shielded target cannot be shielded again for 15 seconds. And we're already at Smite Rank 2, so Keep that's that's gonna feel like quite a boost as well. Let's drag that out to our bar. Let's drag Power Word Shield out to our bar, and yeah, there we go. It's going to get fun from here. Now we're not going to get spell pushback. We're not going to take damage, even when stuff is just pummeling us in the face. It's going to be pretty easy to deal with things. I'm having fun on the Priest. I, I love the Priest. It's one of my favorite classes. We had a lot of fun on the Human Priest. I am curious to know what you guys think about the Priest. Let me know your thoughts. I would love to hear from you. And until next time, take care of yourselves out there and take care of each other. And we will see you back here again sometime very soon. Bye for now.